Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So good to be here today. I'm back with another reaction. I'm going to be checking out Eddie Vedder, NASA Artems. And this was suggested when I recently checked out one of the songs from Pear Jam. And today is a day for the next song from Eddie Vedder. So without further talking, let's dive into it. Invincible. So on with a few, uh, we're going to just play a, play a few new songs on you. Try them on, see if they fit. Wow, his voice actually. Thinking about it. Is that really him? This must be more recent than the one I watched, so. Are we clear? Wow. Clear for lift off. Take off. Yeah. Hmm. Are we affirmative? No negatory. Come in, come in. Radio, what's your story? Are you ask a kilo? I feel like okay, is um I don't know if this song if it has like um something to do with the NASA or if he's just kind of featuring them or I really don't know, but so far he looks very different. Okay, yeah, maybe I know the one I checked out recently was a bit maybe older and this is more recent, but so far the voice sounds so different already and very interesting. So let's keep going. Well, you're welcome. Are you ready for a better, a better back of Victor? Hmm. Whoa. This is... I'm kind of having goosebumps. <laughs> His voice is good. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay. There's a future in need of a friend. Got the spinning in my brain. There's a theory for everything. Resurrection to the big old bang. Rock mining off to the excitement game. We got the density of our beings. The unbearable way. The unbearable light. The unbearable way. Let's live. Wow. wow. I'm invincible. I really love his voice. This this aggressiveness, is this passion in his voice when he's singing. I always like it. It's like his voice tells you what is happening in the song. He he just acts the song out. I really don't know the connection between the song and the NASA, but I see that they're kind of showing uh, is it a takeoff of a is it a spaceship or ship or a rocket or something and it's like invincible how they take off and how they go into space and everything. This is actually so interesting but I don't know the connection it actually has. Maybe there is. I'm not, I'm not sure. I always love this about his songs. Wow.
I really love this song. Wow. Wow, that was powerful from the beginning to the end. His voice is really powerful. It's really amazing. It kind of captivates you as he sings because, you know, this is this attitude he puts when he's singing. Like from the two songs or three songs that I've heard him sing. You know, then he was even quite younger, and this he looks like you know quite older now. The song is still powerful. His voice is more pronounced now. Like so different. Very, every word is very audible. Like you can hear everything. It's, it is it, a melody. His voice actually carries, apart from the melody of the song, his voice alone is like kind of music already to your ears. And I really like the idea of the, the song what it has to do with NASA, I'm not so sure, but I see like the spaceship, the, is it a rocket or the spaceship or whatever it is, the connection it has, you know, invincible. And it's always a mystery how NASA gets to do all those things, like how the rocket goes, how they launch it and invincible goes into space and does whatever it needs to be do. And it's, it's the science is just very, you know, fascinating. Like he said, invincible. You just imagine. You don't even know how it happens, you know. But somehow, so the song. I really enjoy the song. I love the play. This it's it's just a very feel feel good song. It's not dull. It's beginning to the end was just really nice. I really enjoyed it. It was awesome, awesome. Wow. Thank you so much for hanging and checking out this with me. Please remember to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you all in my next video from me. It's bye.